And the tasty delight I'm tackling now, it's a bacon sandwich. My mate Pete swears by his version, and I swear by mine. We both start with white bread. Well, mine's got to be square, I'm afraid. Yeah, and mine's got to be a blue <laughs> round. And of course, it's got to be streaky for me as well. And for me, it's got to be smoked back bacon, always. Let's do it. First of all, I always put the bacon into a cold pan. No oil at all, so it cooks in its own fat. I turn it on really, really low so it melts before it colours. That's the most important thing. Beautiful. So what I'm doing is just a little bit of oil in a pan just to stop it sticking. I believe the best way to cook bacon is under the grill. As it kind of blasts it, it does funny things and it curls up. And the eye meat kind of creates this little cup that has this like natural little pork sort of gravy inside it. The problem with that is, right, all the bits that have curled up and bubbled, they're not going to get crisp on the bottom. Get something to wear down with. You know, just a little pan like that. OK, so actually mine's done, Pete. Yeah, mine is it's, it's really nice and flat. Next, I assemble a sandwich before the final cook. Ooh. I've just got to have a tiny bit of butter in the bread. That's right for me. See, I don't like to take it to the point where it's actually crisp and you can snap it. A perfect layer of bacon and I should pop it back in the pan. All that lovely bacon fat is just going to pick up in the bottom of the sandwich. Just to make sure the bottom is perfectly evenly coloured, I sometimes put the weight on it. Well, let me tell you what happens to my sandwich. I'm not going to butter my bread. Take the bacon to one side. I'm just going to get my eating side there and clean off any of those bits here uh, and push the middle bit down so there's that lovely fry in there as well. Oh, yeah. Next stage is the slicing. Bacon rashers are going that way, north to south. So that means I slice east to west, giving you four fingers of sandwich. I'm going right. to show you how technical mine is. Get a knife, uh, go from one corner to one corner, and just cut it in half. And that's it. All we need now is a bit of sauce for our sarnies. I love a bit of brown, but Pete likes a mix of ketchup, mustard and chilli sauce. Why don't I try a bit of yours, you try a bit of mine? Yeah. Whoa. Oh, that's nice. All your fat is in the centre and it's delicious. I like the difference of texture of the crispy, the soft, and then the crispy again. So it's like triple pleasure. Thank you, Pete. That was lovely. It's a pleasure, man. I enjoyed it. And Same got... time tomorrow? Yeah. <laughs> For selected recipes, please go to jamieoliver.com forward slash comfort food. <laughs>